pre-showing, I was appreciating my value by appreciating the source that plays me. In this game of life, there are really levels to it. And having graduated the levels without stepping on toes or, you know, saying I'm better than anybody, graduating from all the levels to where now I am officially in alignment with the metaphysical level, I am acknowledging and recognizing my metaphysical rank. The idea of rank isn't just a random thing that humans came up with that they're trying to absolve. It's genuinely a thing. We are played by a source. Luckily, I am played by a source that, like in my last reading, created me to be my own self. There are people out there who are played by sources that do not believe in sense of self at all. That is what an NPC is. That is what a bot is. An energy that is purely here for their sources gain or loss because it has been quickly seen that caging Freedom goes against any being's will. And while I was musing with my friends and family, we were laughing at simply that, how I like to play my own games. And they're games that they find exciting. It's like someone with a dog and they train the dog, you know, they give the dog all the advantages of being with that owner. Yet the owner knows that the best out of this dog is with everything that I've blessed this dog with and with everything the dog blesses me with. The type of loyalty I channel through this heart connection is one of independence. Nobody likes an animal that you have to bitch slap into loyalty. The most fun you have out of friendship, out of connection, out of love is when the, the person, the being, the heart loves you for you. And loving you for you is loving you on its own accord. That's the sadness going on throughout the diaspora at this time. Those who once I was loyal to by abuse are now strained at the jugular because of the realization that, oh my God, we treated her without kindness. We are nothing like her. We made assumptions that just because this dog was loyal, that meant we loved her. But that's not the case. That's not the case at all. Loyalty is gained. Just like anything that appreciates in value, it's an overtime accumulation of understanding that garden, knowing that garden, researching that garden, loving that garden, admiring that garden, having hope and talking to that garden, just like all the videos of the advances in science where a soft voice versus a hard voice talking to water, talking to plants, talking to trees, what happens? When I look outside my window, I see the bushes and the tree right in front here, how luscious they are, how boisterous they are. Then I look at the trees on other aspects of the home where my voice doesn't 
reach and they're dead. That says something. That says something about the energies that interact with those portions of the house. Love is felt throughout all. My voice keeps up the maintenance of this home. And heart connections that lack due to my absence and that absence only being because I'm no longer a loyal doggy to anyone else but myself is why the heart has aspects in which just like that sound that came from my throat it is as if these beings sucked in so much helium that they're floating and like it you'll float on On and on.